So, what is up guys? Welcome to NK Gaming's channel and uh, today we are playing some Space Engineers. We are out in space and we're going to build our own station here. Um, so the, things, the thing about uh, Space Engineers is uh, when we're here in uh, survival mode we need uh, to built up some uh, supplies so we can uh, survive for uh, for some time and uh, so we we can have like car con cargo containers we're gonna have some uranium we can put our, uh, in our reactors and uh, by doing that we can uh, we can start building some complicated things and uh, we can uh, be able to make our own station a pretty awesome place to be so the first thing we're gonna do is so uh, we're gonna go around here and uh, I'm gonna check check all of our supplies how we're gonna how how the stand is how the status is uh, how much uranium we have in our um, reactor here so um, here we can see we have a uh, 0 0.37 kilograms um, that's pretty okay because our power consumption is pretty low at the moment mainly because we have nothing in our refinery and nothing in the assembler but uh, that will soon be changing. So what am I uh, what am I going uh, am I going to do about this? Yeah. I am going out with my drill. I'm just putting it down in my toolbar and um, we're going to go out uh, on our little asteroid here and let's just find out if we can uh, we have some, sorry, we have some uranium or some uranium ores here on the planet or the asteroid. Um because we're gonna need that soon when we're starting to refine and uh, and assemble stuff. Um, so that's what we're gonna do. Um, we're gonna find out what we're actually gonna build a, a bit, little bit later when our supplies is just filled up a little bit more. Um, of course, it's really nice for us to have have some more supplies that we can rely on, and and uh, that's why we're just flying around the the asteroid to find out if. Uh, if we actually have some uranium here so we can power up our ship maybe uh, later in our process um, we can uh, we can have some solar power going solar power going on but uh, we'll just see see if uh, we think that's uh, that's good so um, looks like we have quite a bit of iron on the planet um, iron is gonna be a resource we're gonna we're gonna depend on because you know we you know the platform is built of of, of like only steel plates and steel plates yeah that's just iron so maybe you know first I'm gonna just uh, see if you we actually have some uranium what materials materials we have here on the asteroid and uh, if we don't have some uranium, I'm just uh, gonna take some uh, iron with me up to the platform to refine. Uh, when the when the iron is refining, we're we just uh, we're just gonna fly out to one of the other asteroids and uh, find some uranium there. So uh, looks like we are not lucky and can't find actually. Oh, actually, right there, jackpot. So now we have to find out where we're going in the smartest way looks like we're gonna have the the reservoir of uh, uranium in here so um, let's start mining so out here uh, we don't have don't have other, uh, many other things than stone so actually now I'm just right clicking that's just that's just destroying all the stone until we get into the uranium then we're gonna left click and we can uh, drill I'm just gonna turn on the light so we can uh, so we can see a little bit here. Oh, here goes the uranium. Nice. And uh, unfortunately, we are not uh, in a mining ship which uh, which can pick up the ores itself. So uh, now we're just gonna press T a lot to pick up all these ores. The good thing about uranium is that. Uh, uh, it has just so so much power in it. We're not gonna need that much. Also, I've been quite a bit of a cheater because I I, I might have uh, put up the the drill and the grinding speed all of that speed up so we can just have a little quite quite a bit more fun, but still enjoy that kind of um, survival mode ish uh, mode 
this play. So, okay, here we have some stone. We don't want stone. Um, actually, I just made up this world for us, but I can see. Hmm, what is that? A private sail. I've been told that that's some kind of ships flying around, and we can take uh, take the ship and get all the materials ma uh, that it's made up of. So I think after we have some uranium here, we're gonna fly out to that. If I'm actually able to get out, I can't really orient ar 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 myself here. So, uh, looks like we have quite a bit of uh, uranium. So I'm gonna put up, go up and put that in the refinery, and uh, maybe we'll... Oh, heck, why not just see if uh, there's a bit of uh, iron on the way? Yeah, we're not gonna waste time going in there. So now I'm going up and putting. Uh, I'm gonna put the the uranium ores in the refinery, and uh, when that's refined, we can uh, basically be up and running on quite a quite a bit of power. Um, and uh, heck, guys, why why not just fly out there and uh, search that private sale thing? It looks like it's a bit out there in the the far far out of here so uh, I'm just gonna recharge myself and uh, then the, uh, then we're we're just going out there why not so now we're fully charged and we can fly out to that bloody thing out there I'm quite uh, I'm quite surprised that uh, the thing all uh, already dropped now um, I thought they were gonna be come coming a lot later in the game process but I guess um, I guess it's just all random. Um, I really hope they have the materials we can hit so uh, so we can start off building some um, so we can build our own little ship to mine because uh, when we have a mining ship, it's gonna be so incredibly much easier for us to mine, um, and that's gonna that's gonna uh, make us uh, uh, or gonna make our space station a much better place to be. When uh, when the mining is quite a bit easier, so I'll uh, just take the dampeners off, so we're flying out of into space um, without without our jetpack. Seems like that thing could be. I just think it's a miner ship. Probably not not anything special. Let's see. Hmm. It's actually flying. I really don't get this because. Um, it should be real hard to make things just fly out. But so guys, I have to admit I've seen these a few times before, like in other gameplays and such. And I know, I know, on the outside you can see it should be pretty hard to get in. Uh, but uh, I know a little, little way in. So what I, uh, from what I've seen here in the back end, or <laughs> the butt, the ass, I, sh I think we should be able to just fly in here, oh fuck, that wasn't so clever, grind up this, and uh, then uh, a door should be behind this, jackpot man, the thing is, access is denied, so uh, we're gonna grind through this door, it's uh, it's pretty nice that uh, we already get this job right now because uh, we need so uh, so much steel and so much so many materials. Um, that's gonna be be a real real real. Oh, sorry, man. I'm just rambling. The iron we can get from this that's just gonna be the bread and butter for us. Uh, wow, that wasn't so damn clever. So when we're getting the materials from this ship, we can actually. Uh, do quite a lot of things. Oh, I was upside down, man. I don't understand why the why the seat was so 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 awkwardly placed. Let's see if we can go in here. Access denied as well. So it looks like we're gonna grant this this up up also. Yes. Man, I'm so happy I uh, set the speed of the grinding a bit up because it can be real a real 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 pain in the ass to just wait for these kinds of things. So, um, now I'm gonna see if I can get this place right. Yep. That's a bummer. 
Man, guys. That's just a big waste of time. Let's see if I can place it right this time. Bingo. Let's wheel that that thing up. I am really curious to see if this uh, really holds something good for us. As uh, it's you know it's a small ship, but it should uh, should have quite a lot of steel plates and such in it. So um, so let's let's fly this away. So we're in the ship, and uh, the platform is really really a long distance away. So this is gonna be we're gonna have some waiting time before we get up to our own ship again. <clears throat> so uh, I've been enjoying Space Engineers quite a lot. I think it's a real, real, real good game because uh, for me, Minecraft is not that exciting. I played it uh, some years ago, and I just didn't enjoy the experience. You know, I'm the kind of guy that that just uh, uh, that doesn't play a game because I think the graphics are just disappointing. But the thing about Minecraft isn't it it's just not only the graphic style I'm not I'm not into but I'm really not into uh, how you how you mine and how you gotta set up all those complicated things the thing with space engineers is that the platform is just like a whole a whole cir a circuit board and uh, that circuit board is just so easy making a lot of uh, when you have the circuit board it's just so easy to make um, make some some complicated things, but make them easily. In Minecraft, you can uh, have to use all that uh, redstone and all that stuff to make uh, the f uh, the machines, the farms and such. Here, it's it's like a bit more simple, and uh, I like that style a bit more. But let's see if we're not we're about to approach our platform. So let's damn man, <laughs> great flying, ain't it? Nope. Let's see if I can stop this ship. And I am gonna fly it over, and then we're grind it up. We're gonna grind it up because uh, this should have some inter uh, interesting materials for us. Wow, this thruster, man! I didn't calculate that it was gonna take this long. But guys, I really hope you're gonna enjoy this series because uh, I think we can make some uh, nice stuff here. Um, you know, oh my mother, jeez, am I just the stupidest guy ever? I just flew into the fucking platform. <laughs> Man, well, guess it's stationary at least. <laughs> Man, that is just, what am I doing? I didn't figure the ship was that large. Oh man, that's just a major brain fart. So looks like we're already. Uh... Oh my god, man, guys, I'm just uh, that's that's just humiliating. That is just humiliating. I can't even stand looking at my own body r line right there. So um, I was gonna say before that uh, we can already see what we're going gonna do. Uh, we're gonna. Oh wait, this guy should have something on him. Uh, we're gonna. Yes, a lot of things actually. The first project we're gonna we're gonna start off is of course we're gonna grind the ship down. I think I'm gonna do that after the episode is done, and uh, when the ship is uh, grinded up and we have all the, those good materials, we are actually gonna start uh, redoing the platform, repairing it, and uh, one of the first things, other than the mining ship, I think is really essential, is to get a good conveyor system. The conveyor system will uh, will make us able to like uh, just mine come out and mine then I'm, I'm thinking that we're making the conveyor belts or the conveyor tubes out here from there out here then we're just gonna fly out uh, in with our ship and connect the two pieces with uh, with a connector I think or an ejector 
um, and when uh, the two uh, two blocks are connected, we can easily uh, get all of our our ores down in the refinery, and we can order things in the assembler. Also, I am hoping to to make uh, the the conveyor to go down here to the reactor as well. Uh, by that, we can uh, when the refining process of, uh, for instance, uranium. When when the uranium is uh, the uranium, uranium ores is refined, they're just going to go directly into the reactor, and that's going to be a major power source. So uh, we're gonna we're gonna start cranking this uh, ship up. So the tricky part is that we're not gonna uh, we're not going grind gonna grind it from the inside here because the parts are just gonna float off into space. So we're starting from the outside and moving inwards. Um. But uh, looks like the episode is coming to an end. I want I don't want to waste your time by looking at me just grinding. Uh, I hope you enjoyed, and uh, I hope you'll be watching more videos. Um, I should be making more Space Engineers uh, videos if you like them. So uh, just leave a comment, and uh, we'll see if you like this series. Uh, also, leave a comment on things you'd like to see me building, uh, because. Uh, I really hope the this world and this game will will be a more interacting uh, will be really interactive for you to to be in this uh, or this series has to be uh, like you. Could, oh man, I'm just rambling out again. I want this series to be a, an interaction with the viewer. So uh, you say what you think uh, I need to build, and uh, I'll see if I can build it. So uh, thank you, thank you very much for watching. And uh, after I've just uh, put these things in the assembler, I should be out. So um, uh, goodbye, guys, and uh, I hope you will see see each other soon, man. Goodbye.